Hey guys, it's Jen with another painting. Um, sorry about my voice. It's a little stuffy. I've been having some allergies. And anyway, so my nose is a little stuffy. So I apologize for that. Um, anywho, this painting is just a, a simple, silly, little fun painting that I'm doing as a donation piece. Um, it's for a fundraiser for animals. I can't remember the name of it because my brain is kind of mush today, but I will put the the link or the link in the description box to the fundraiser. Um, I am naming this piece Paper Garden, and I don't have a frame for it yet, uh, but, but I will be getting a frame for it. And it turned out really cute and colorful. Um, we all know how... I, we all know how I like colors. Um, anyways, while you watch me paint this and work on this one, I have a, a couple romantic poems I want to read. I, rom I am a romantic at heart. I love romance. I live by romance. I will die by romance. I am like cheesy romantic. Freaking love it. Anywho, like I've been reading romance novels since I was a freaking, I don't even know, like 12 years old. Everyone deserves romance in their lives. Um, and romance is not just reserved for couples. Like, y even if you're single, you can romance yourself, okay? Until your partner comes along. You can light yourself a candle at dinner. You can buy yourself a weekly bouquet of fresh flowers. You can take a, a bubble bath with, like, essential oils and flower petals in it. All right? You can take yourself out for a drink or to go see a movie. Um... But anyways, I hope you're romancing yourself or romancing your partner and just living your best romantic life. The first poem is by Tyler Knott Gregson, and it goes, I will never be the first of so many things for you. I came too late after life and love were already woven into the tapestry of your existence. I care not about lost firsts, but I will fight, knuckles bloody and teeth sharpened for all of your lasts. Take the old firsts and put them to rest, silent below the dirt and ash of all the new ones that we will burn through together. Take them, but give me your every last. Ugh. That freaking poem is so sweet. It's so romantic to me. I love it. Um, and then the second poem is by Rocky Stonehenge. And it says, There is a place of peace. There is a place of joy. A place away from loneliness. And a place away from pain. That place is next to you. A secret garden where black and white becomes a colorful place of loving, kissing, touching, caressing. There with you and only you, the cares of the world melting away. Anger and fear are not allowed and prejudice cannot enter. A place where two hearts beat as one. A place where two souls are interwoven, touching the inner place of one another. A place that I long to come back to again and again. A place of sweet abandon. A place next to you. Anywho, I hope you liked those two poems. I was just um, online reading them and I just thought they were so sweet. And, you know, they're just quick and simple little romantic poems. And isn't it nice when somebody dedicates a song to you or writes you a poem like, I don't know if you've ever had a man or a woman like or whoever you're with write a poem for you or just say something like really random and you're just blown away by how cute and romantic it all was. But that feeling just makes you feel so loved, so cherished, so special. And romance is just so sweet. How can you not love it? You know, like... You don't have to be super cheesy or like 
I don't know, gush over romantic movies to enjoy romance, you know? You could be the manliest man of all men and still enjoy romance. Um, but anywho, enough about that. This painting is just a simple, fun one I did. And I hope you enjoyed watching me paint it. It turned out pretty cute. Um, it did take a long time to do the dots, but other than that, it was just a simple little little painting. And I don't know if I told you, I, I named it Paper Garden. Um, but anywho, uh, I hope you enjoyed watching me paint this. Thank you so much for supporting my channel, for liking my videos, for sharing my videos, for sharing links to my channel, um, for all of your subscribes, for all of your comments. I appreciate everything, all the comments, all the shares, just everything. You guys mean so much to me. I hope I am inspiring you, entertaining you. Um, anyways, whatever. Love you all. Here's the reveal. I went outside and took it out because it was so colorful and I thought it would look good on the ground. All right. Until next time, I'll see you later. Bye.